Hi my YouTube friends, Sandra from ForYourChi.com here, here today to do your weekly tarot and oracle card reading for April 11th through April 17th of 2022. Thanks so much for being here with me. Okay, so let's get into this. And by the way, anyone that's a Scorpio, Scorpio, Sun, Rising, Moon, Mercury, or North Node Scorpio, I received a downloaded message last night, so I will be making a separate video for Scorpios. It is not for cross watchers, it is only for the Scorpios, but I was up for th about three and a half hours getting that download, so I know that I have to do that soon. But uh, regardless, so let's get to your collective reading. Okay, Monday, Tuesday, stand your ground. It is, this is kind, this relates to the Scorpio message that I was getting, or anyone with prominent placements in Scorpio. Look, there's a lot of BS that's going on in this world, but it starts with you in your life, in your own personal life, and specifically in your home life. Don't let anyone, especially your children, try to BS you and talk you into something that you know is wrong. Specifically, I'm saying that this is pertains to your home life because we have Vesta saying your household situation is going to improve through a move or some other healthy change. Now, this talks about occupants, which, you know, is people coming and going. Uh, this could be an older child moving out for sure, but it the main reason why it changes everyone is because you're not having it anymore. You've had enough. This is your, I'm drawing the line in the sand card and you're not crossing it anymore. You have had enough. And this is a sign, a confirmation rather, to put your foot down. All right. Now let me just let, let me just go back to the home card for a minute. Because some of you this may not apply to your physical home where you live, but this could apply to relatives who live outside of your home as well. Okay? So take that as it resonates whether it's your parents, you know, your brother or sister, anyone that's trying to have their way when you know that it's not the correct way it's n it's not the correct way to go for you personally all right now here we go wednesday thursday this is the moon card in traditional tarot inward reflection the card of the introvert and you are looking at the shadow side of things, whether it's the shadow side of your life, uh, different lives of people around you, or just the current events that are happening right now. And you can clearly see here, look at this, Colleen, endings and beginnings, the old must be released so that the new can enter. So this is definitely a doorway closing out what no longer serves you to open up new avenues of what is more suitable for you. Leaving the old toxic ways, leaving the old toxic people so that the new and beautiful can enter your life. But you must consciously choose to do this. Now that can be saying goodbye to old friends or family members that are just take, take, taking like leeches, or it can be unfriending people on social media. Or for some of you, it's just going to be the quiet recognition and saying to yourself in the higher power and the universe, whatever label you want to put it on it, you know, I don't, I'm not a stickler for that. It's whatever you believe in. Okay, I'm done with this now. I'm closing the door and I'm opening a new door to something more. Insert the, insert the word in the blank here. Prosperous, profitable, loving, easy, 
whatever you are tired of, it's time to close the door now. People, places, situations, things. All right. The card, I like it. The card for Friday, Saturday, Sunday, much better. Light, prosperity, and bliss are assured here. And specifically because you've made this conscious decision earlier in the week to peace out on things that are no longer serving your highest good and interests and best interests. And I love it here, Coventina Purification. This talks about body purification, but also energy purification, and many of you need both. Frankincense oil, I talk about it all the time. A smudge stick works. If you can take a sea salt bath, if you're able to do that, that's great. Because that works on cleansing the, detoxifying the physical body and your energy at the same time. If you can do yoga, even better, that clears out the chakras. But the main purification that's happening here is your conscious choice to leave the old toxic ways and the old toxic people behind. Because they don't belong in the future, not with you. You're moving on up, my friend, to higher levels. Upgrading, as they say. And it's not a New York apartment in the sky. It's something much greater than that. Thanks for being here with me. Many blessings. Look for my Scorpio videos for those of you that it pertains to. Many blessings. Take care.